Oh boy, it's been a while, but I do have a box opening. Yay! It is the new Barbie Signature Looks model number 18. Oh, hey. A box came today, and it is the Looks model number 18. And you can see all of the Looks dolls on the back here. And 18 is this guy right here. The reason why that I wanted him so bad is because he has like the Batman sculpted body. So he's very, very muscular. And the Kins of the past were kind of smaller, right? Um, this guy, I don't know if you can see it very well in the pictures, but he is super muscular. He's the only one of the new looks um, dolls that I've gotten. And I had to open him up right away. So here he is, guys. And his hands are a little different. Um, I personally like that. I think that he can hold things uh, pretty well with hands like that. And they are kind of rubbery, not stiff. So um, I think that helps him to be able to hold things as well. And um, his biceps are huge, obviously. Let's see those muscles, man. There we go. Yeah, he's very muscular. I love that. I know I'll have to make a lot of clothes for him, which I love to make the doll clothes anyway, and I'll probably sell some too because I'm sure other people need clothes uh, for this this particular kin. But I do not, unlike most people, I think with this line, I do not care for the block color clothes. I just, no, they don't even, like the colors don't even go together. And the blue is different in the shoes than it is in the shorts. I mean, none of this really matches or goes together. Um, I do like the look of the shoes. I think I'll probably paint them white though. Um, because you know, it's, it's a, just a light blue plastic. That's just, you know, not that realistic. Um, the face is so cute. The screening's really good. I really like it. I think one eyebrow is raised up a little higher, um, than the other one, but Hey, they're sisters, not twins. Okay. So I'm good with that. I'm okay with that. Um, one eye might be a little higher than the other, but you know, hey, whatever. I'm good with that. <laughs> I'm not sending him back because um, they keep running out of him. Uh, Amazon keeps running out and having to get more in. And uh, yeah, so I'm afraid I, I wouldn't have one if I sent him back. I'm just going to keep him the way that he is. And then maybe it's just me. The eyebrow, yeah, one eyebrow is higher than the other. Maybe the eyeballs just look that way because of the eyebrow, I'm not sure. But I love the lips. Um, he's got some big puckery lips, I like that. And he has like this dimple. Um, I love the dimple. He's got a dimple on either side. And then the five o'clock shadow type of thing is drawn in there, it's not flocked, but it's done really, really well where it looks realistic, right? Um, the hair flocking is really nice and that's on both sides. So he's got flocking on that side and that side. Um, and then this like long mohawk kind of thing in the middle. Um, it is, it has got some gel in it, so it probably does need to be, you know, washed out or whatever. But the look is really cool. I really like this guy. Love the fact that he's a different body shape. And I want to do a video on, um, the differences between like the Barbies, how they've gone from the 50s when Barbie came out to what we have now in, in the style of Barbies. And the same thing with the Kins. Um, I don't have the very earliest Kins at all, but um, I, I do wanna do some sort of video on that and how they have changed over time. But for right now, I just really wanted to show you guys um, my Barbie looks. Um, would you still call him a Ken? Barbie looks Ken doll. <laughs> Barbie looks model number 18, I guess, um, would be how I would say that. But let's get him unclothed just so we can see the rest of his body type. Okay, so here he is undressed. And for those who hate naked dolls or whatever, he is not naked because they have a little pair of underwear uh, molded onto his body. So he is not naked. <laughs> However, he is super muscular, like these thighs. Wow, those are huge. Um, the six pack in the middle there, the arm muscles are huge. And then you flip him over and look at the back muscles. He even has these huge back muscles there. 
got quite the tush. I guess you have to have that to hold up, you know, the uh, the big size there. But let's see how he compares to my other um, looks doll from the past here. This one, <laughs> which is more of a normal like size body, I would say that Ken usually comes in. You can see the difference in like the six pack here is so much more defined. Um, the arms, which this one, I have little tattoos that I've put on him, but, um, yeah, but yeah, look at the arms just between the two. We've got, let's see if I can do it this way. I mean, that's a huge difference, right? That is a huge difference, even in the forearm there. Um, the thighs between this thigh and this thigh, huge difference, right? Just like a huge difference. Um, let's see if the feet are the same. Looks like the feet are probably the same size. Looks like that's the same. Other than that, obviously I would have to make him close because he is not at all the same size as the kins, you know, that I normally have. So, um, I definitely will be doing that, but that's why I like these dolls is because there's so many different body shapes. Um, I like that on the girl Barbies. I like that on the Ken dolls as well. I just like the fact that we're celebrating different body types and different uh, shapes. I do wish we had a fluffy Ken doll with a little pudge and not so much of the muscles, but maybe a little fluffy Ken doll. I think that that would be really cool to have as well. So um, just putting that out there, Mattel, maybe you could make us some, some fluffy guys. Um, but yeah, this is, this is my Barbie, uh, Barbie looks, would it, would it be called Barbie looks or Ken look? I guess it's Barbie signature looks, um, model number 18. So, um, yeah, this has been really fun. I really want to get still, I want to get this lady here because I really love natural hair on ethnic dolls. Um, and then I don't know from there, I like maybe these two because of the body shapes, but I'm not, you know, like this line is not one I want to rush out and buy every one of like the last one. Um, the last wave was really cool, really great clothes, really good, different, different, um, body types, but also different face looks, you know, they different looks on their faces. And this one, I mean, to me, it doesn't look as realistic. The face, you know, sculpts or whatever, just the way that they've done them just aren't as realistic, I think, as what I would like um, for me. Um, the body shapes as well, like, I don't know, just kind of same old, same old, except for this guy. He was the prize winner for me this wave, and I am so excited to have him, so. Yeah, hope you guys are having a great day. Thank you for watching uh, my little box opening, which was already kind of opened because um, this was a gift sent to me and I wanted to um, do FaceTime with the person who sent the gift to me um, because, you know, I owed them that. <laughs> I was so excited and so happy to have him that definitely I wanted, uh, I wanted to show them how happy I was that they would gift him to me. So thank you guys. I hope you're having a wonderful day. It's beautiful out here in Indiana. I hope it's beautiful where you are and I'll see you guys soon.